So here's the kit here. Uh, it's actually come straight out of the US. Basically it's a test facility. You can see that uh, the first thing you might notice is that these tiny little things in here, which you maybe can't see so well, are actually the LEDs. Um, now these are Philips LumiLED LEDs. And I'm just going to give you a quick punch and see what that looks like. So you can see that it's actually a blue light that's emitted. Um, and uh, you'll find that most white LEDs are actually blue LEDs uh, with a phosphor over the top of them. Um, and that's uh, what these little plates are for. So there's a selection from 5000K down to 2700K and a, a few different uh, colour rendering indexes. Um, basically, I'll just, I'll just pull one on and I'll give you a quick look at what actually happens. So you can see that it's actually a, a very white light. It's um, what's considered as blue for a lot of people um, in residential applications and maybe doesn't go so well. Uh, so what you might want to do is choose something that's a little bit warmer colour temperature. And this goes all the way down to the other end of the spectrum. We're emitting a, a very nice warm white. Uh, this is 2700 Kelvin, the same as uh, an incandescent. So you can see that by choosing the different phosphor grades, you can basically choose what colour temperature you want. And I'm just going to pull this one out right in the centre here at 3500 Kelvin. You can see that it's not quite warm and not quite cool. Um, so yeah, that's basically the different types of phosphor that are used. Um, this particular method called remote phosphor is where the phosphor is not actually doppleted over the chip. Um, instead, it's, it's remote. So what was once blue now becomes white.